Welcome to Cert Bros. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to configure DHCP on a Cisco router. So here's our scenario. On the left, we have our router that we're going to be configuring DHCP on. And on the right, we have our host PC connected by a switch. So we'll jump right in and open up our router. We're going to type enable, configure terminal, service DHCP. This will enable DHCP. Now we're going to type IP DHCP pool and we have to give it a name. So in this example, we're going to use main pool. This creates the DHCP pool. Next, we'll create the IPs to be used within this pool we've just made. And we do this by typing network 192 .1 .0, 255.255.255.0. Now you can use any IP address range you want, but just for this example, we're telling it to use anywhere between 192.168.1.1 to 192.168.1.0. .1 because that's the available host within that range. Now we'll set a default router by typing default router 192.168.1.254. Now this is the address that you want to set as the default router on your host PCs. It can be any address you want. I've just used this one as an example. We'll do DNS server 192.168.1.1. Again, you can use whatever you like for that. Domain name searchbros.com, just an example. Now we'll come out of here and type exit. We can exclude addresses as well by typing IP DHCP exclude address and the address we want to exclude. So for example, if you want to exclude the router's IP address itself, we can type 192.168.1.254. You may also have a file server you want to exclude. So you just type the same thing, 192.168.1.1 or whatever address you want to exclude. Now I forgot to set the least time, but it's worked out all right because I can show you that we can go back in and edit our pool just by typing IP DHCP pool, main pool, and it opens up our pool again. So to set the lease type, we can type lease 900. This is days, hours, and minutes. That's it for the router side. Let's jump over to the PC. We'll just double check that we're set to receive IP addresses from DHCP. So we'll go start, control panel. We'll search for network. View network connections, right click, properties, IPv4, now that's all set, we can open up the command prompt just by going to start cmd and we'll type ipconfig. As you can see, we've received our IP addresses from our router. Now, if we jump back over to our router, we can verify this just by going back in, enable, show IP DHCP bindings.
as you can see it will show our leases and you can see our host PC there. That's it for configuring DHCP, very simple, hope you enjoyed watching the video, thank you for watching.